Hey guys and welcome to my October TBR. Um, today I am just going to be going over the books that I am going to be reading for the month of October. I'm going to list the ones I'm definitely going to be reading. I'm tired of listing a bunch of books for you guys and then I'm not able to follow through so I kind of I don't want to be a disappointment to you guys. So I'm going to keep it kind of light and then if I have room I will add extras to it and then you guys see them at my um, October wrap up. But yeah anyways let's get started. Alright so the first book that I plan on reading in the month of October is The Iron Trial by Holly Black and Cassandra Clare. Uh, I really really badly want to read this so I decided why not in the month of October because I heard it has to do with wizards and and such so why not add this to the mix for October. The second book that I plan on reading in the month of October is going to be Percy Jackson and the Olympians um, by Rick Riordan. This is the Sea of Monsters. This is the second book in the Percy Jackson series. I plan on working my way through them. I know The Blood of Olympus um, is coming out on October 7th so I plan on buying the box set for that and then also working my way through that. But yes, gotta start somewhere so I'm probably gonna, at least going to do um, try for one or two of these. The third book I plan on reading in the month of October is going to be Miss Peregrine's Home for Peculiar Children um, by Ransom Riggs and I figured this is perfect for Halloween. I'm in the mood to read some scary stories so I'm hoping this will be a little bit chilling and this is also um, my book club's pick for the month so I will be reading this with them. Okay so this next book I've already started it but I plan on finishing it in the month of October and that is going to be Outlander by Diana Gabaldon. Um, I hopefully will be able to get through this chunker. I got quite a bit left. Um, we'll see if I can get through it or not and if I can't finish this I plan on starting on Dragonfly and Amber, which is the second book in the Outlander series by Diana Gabaldon. So yes, this one seemed actually a lot, feels a lot, it is a lot smaller, um, which I figured it was than Outlander is. So hopefully I will be able to at least get some of this done. I'm just going to slowly work my way through this series as well because there's like eight or nine books and they're all huge. So yeah. Alright guys, um, I know normally I do a TBR jar pick, but I'm not going to do that this month. Um, I'm just going to keep it light. Like I said, I don't want to disappoint you guys, so I'm just going to leave it with those books for now. And then if I add to it, I will let you guys know. But yes, that's all I have for you guys today, and I will see you next time. Bye! Mwah.